Hey, everybody. Welcome back. Welcome back to more Zero Time Dilemma. This is part 14. In the last episode, we did the transporter room, and then we unwittingly went into a back-to-back -back scenario <laughs> with the next room, which is the locker room. And I didn't know. I... And then we just, like, ended because we were super hangry. <laughs> so here's something crazy. So normally on the main menu, I'm used to seeing just a black screen with a little watch. But since we didn't finish the the room, the background is the room that we're in. And I've never seen this before because at no point when I was playing the game originally did I ever stop in the middle of a room. I always just completed them. So I had no idea that it did this. It was really cool to see, actually. That is really cool. Because I remember thinking, like, man, the main menu is really boring. Why is it like this? But it's because it does this, like, for, for wherever you are. I That's just wish cool. it would show like where what, what the last room you did was or something like that mm -hmm. you know well it probably helps you to get a little refreshed on your way into the game true you'd be like oh brian i was in this room by the way if you're um wondering this is an They're olipop not. ginger ale no one's wondering i'm just kidding it's very yummy it's really good i'm it just saying i'm not sponsored yet but so maybe like don't maybe don't buy too much. Maybe save it for when I get sponsored, and then buy a whole boatload. Yeah, 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 yeah. To really impress them. Um, but yeah, it's, it's pretty good. If you like ginger ale? I'm just saying. It tastes like candy it's, ginger, it's, but like in the good way, in the sweet way, not in like the. I like it more ginger than way. Candy, you know candy dry and sweeps and those. Uh, those uh -huh. mainstream ones. What? Every time I hear Canada dry, I have to tell the story of my nephew. He's so being cute. Being too personal with them. I know. He's too cute. He's Speaking he's younger than 10. Are you seriously about... <laughs> Am I about to what? Let me tell my story first. Okay, go ahead. Um, my nephew, younger than 10. All right. He... Right. <laughs> he's so cute. He went up to his, his dad and was like, I would like another Canada Dry. Please. Yeah, and his dad, of course, was just like, they're not called Canada Dry, son. <laughs> he looked, they're just ginger, <laughs> they're ginger ales. Ginger ales. <laughs> but he was very like, friend. I want another Canada Dry. Yeah, he loves he loves Canada Dry, so we always make sure when he comes over that that we have one in the fridge. It's so cute, and he likes we'll the lemon see. the lemon lime. He likes the lemon lime lollipop. So this is the best of both we worlds. Need we need to save him one. Oh yeah. Okay. I'm, I'm, I'm not going to have the last one. You've got you've got one stood away. We need to make sure. Yeah, I've got extra. I'm okay, going to get good. more. Good, 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 it's good, really good. good. It is really good. By the way, if you're wondering where little CK is, never fear. This will be the first video uninterrupted. I feel like we're jinxing ourselves. We've got ourselves a little FaceTime baby monitor action going. Oh yeah. <laughs> what? We haven't gotten a monitor yet. It's so we're okay. FaceTiming. She's embarrassed. She thinks that we're being outed. <laughs> <laughs> this very is a great solution. It is. No, I'm this very great... I'm very proud of this. Your non Canada dry ginger ale is right in front of my daughter. Thank you. <laughs> Stop. <laughs> Don't look at her. Look at me. But we realize she's asleep and we're both awake. We're both awake. So like this is rare. It's very, this isn't very rare. Anymore. And so we're like, if we're she's asleep, in a quick zero time dilemma. One of us is usually asleep, usually me. Yes. Which is why I'm wearing my pajamas. <laughs> yeah. So. Oh, good. Are you? I had to oh, move his I thought... drink over. You, she was moving my drink over. I thought you were going to take a swig and I was about to be like... No, no. I did just brush my teeth, so I need a little extra drink. time before I <clears throat> ginger ale it up over here. All right, I'm going to load us into the locker room. Wasn't that the most exciting intro to a video y'all seen thus far? <laughs> you know what? I haven't seen their comments yet because we're recording this way ahead of time, but right. I'm sure they love it. <laughs> I give them a hard time. I'm not. But they're gonna not evil apologize people. They're not going to be like, get that baby out of here. <laughs> no. Why don't you just talk about the game? Although I have gotten, I there was one video on my main channel 
were it was it was right after she was born the first video uploads after she was born and i was like i so i have a baby but i talked about it for like a couple minutes yeah and there's someone that was just normal. like there's somebody that commented they're just like well he just shut the fuck up about his baby already get back to the game and i was like oh my god oh my god y'all can't see it, oh I'm, my we are reeling that was us reeling like how could you be so evil <sighs> just get are a you life. zero get a life get a life get a life are get? you fucking zero in this game you edgy bastard a life just get a life that's not gay video games are the most important thing in the entire world much more important than a baby i've never wanted to punch a computer <laughs> so hard than in this moment <laughs> And I'm not even mad at see, the computer. They, see, they spend a lot of time with video games, and they spend no time with babies. So therefore, video games are more important than babies. I don't even care about the baby part. It's it's the like clear lack of care for people. Lack, lack Just of people. like lack of like any interest or, or respect for me at all. Yeah. Yeah, it's just it's yeah. this like I, I'm just I'm I'm someone in the, I'm I'm an obstacle for them in the way of the game. Like find so. one of those zero commentary playthroughs then. Bye. Yeah, you know what? If you're getting annoyed right now, you could have watched this no commentary. There's a million of them. There's a million crap no commentary playthroughs out there where there's no editing or cuts at all. And the, they, the person like spends 20 minutes to solve a puzzle, no cuts, but there's no commentary either. Just watch those. Also, it's like part 14, so I'm sure the people here are the yeah, ones who want to be the, here. The no commentary playthrough people, <laughs> the, they'd be on like part 40 by now. Yeah. Oh. The okay. 40, 13 minute videos. Knock yourselves out. Let's get back to the game. Yeah. <laughs> it's a hair dryer. I bet we could use it for something. Great. It's a hair dryer. <laughs> <laughs> we can dry ourselves off with this. Are we wet? <laughs> do we it's need, a hair dryer. Do we need to dry ourselves <laughs> off? I'm a little afraid of getting shocked. We have so much water surrounding us. Yeah. Oh, oh, yeah. by the hair dryer. Right. It's a common I like how, circumstance. I like how whoever mauled the hair dryer got to the nozzle and they're just like no nah, it's just solid black in there yeah they're like whatever <laughs> there's no filter or grill yeah. or anything it's just like now nah, you know what i refuse i also love how because long it is you know that yeah that's true <laughs> you know that like 98 percent of the people that play this game just saw it and they're like okay fine and they hit back yeah and then two percent of us were like what does the nozzle look like and that artist looked at the risk reward and they were like i don't want to have to model that yeah they're like i am tired <laughs> Fuck the two percent. <laughs> they yes. said. You know what? That's fair. They were like, no, those people could just deal. Spin. Okay, yeah, I gotta look at it. Oh, <gasps> the word "spin" is written next to this exhaust fan. Does that mean we should spin this? Does that mean we should spin this? You gotta wonder why they even talk at all sometimes. Yes. Just... But I don't see a power switch, and we can't reach the blades with our fingers. Guess we'll have to find a different way. Oh my god. Oh, we never even talked about this. We have to use the Kimmy's hair- Kimmy's wearing her pajamas. I literally mentioned that already. But I didn't make oh, fun okay. of you for it. <laughs> you did say you would do that. <laughs> and that's what this part is. Look at pajama I'm Kimmy. I'm sweepy. <laughs> oh, you sweepy little baby. <laughs> Man, when, when, when CK goes to sleep, <laughs> the party animals come out. I had some decaf coffee, so I'm ready to party. <laughs> oh they haven't solved a single puzzle yet. We Are you kidding me? I have to run into those people. We have We're to plug in the hair dryer, <laughs> and that's how we make the thing spin. You think we make it spin with the hair dryer? Yeah, you blow the air in there to make you the blow, blades. You blow the fan with the hair dryer. Yeah, it's like a windmill. That's for, that's the most ridiculous thing I've ever heard. It's literally the solution, isn't it? Um, the water doesn't look quite right. I don't know what these conspiracy theories over here are all about. <laughs> I don't know why, but this is my <laughs> yeah, like mind image for conspiracy theories. 
It's but that the looks same like... one for suspicious or scheming. <laughs> this is scheming. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Show them scheming. <laughs> this is conspiracy theory. I, I'm I'm very intrigued by the fact that your conspiracy theorist looks like they're plotting something. Because that's that's what I think conspiracy theorists are doing. Yeah. They're plotting about how to get other people to believe their conspiracy theories. They look like they're the ones conspiring. <laughs> yeah. They are, because they're the ones trying to get people to no, believe I get their conspiracy theories. I know, I just, I, I, I think it's funny. Yeah, we should make an entire video sometime of the visuals that we get when we hear certain words. Yes. Because we do that sometimes. We talk about that a lot. We talk about that, yeah. <laughs> what, what, what's the one um, for... Uh, I know you have a vision of someone who's like, it's like breaking chains or something. For what? I don't remember the word. I just remember it's like. Totally oh, so I'm being like. Ugh. Yeah. I don't know. Is that struggle? Str no, no, no. This is this is struggle. <laughs> Mine is someone going. <laughs> I don't know. That's pretty good too. It's the back and forth motion. <laughs> That's what's key. It's a very buff man too. Going yeah, on. yeah, yeah. Struggling with something. Struggle. Okay, we gotta, we gotta <laughs> do this. We should do this. Okay, um, the water doesn't look quite right. I would even go so far as to say it could be dangerous. Don't step inside. Are we not already stepping? Are we not already stepping inside it? That's where the camera is. Oh no, we Fine. must be. Oh. Thank you. We must be. I just don't want to put my can on the wood. That's here, why I put it on here. the mouse pad. Can just move our daughter. There we go. Now you can put it can here. Can you see her? Yeah, I can. Okay. Now you can put your can back over here. No, apparently not. Oh my god. I think we're on like the boardwalk or whatever. Oh. Let's open this locker. Oh, <gasps> it's some kind of note. Power supply must be restarted to unlock the door. Oh. All okay. right. Right. If only there was a cat in here. Meow, that would perfectly calm my nerves. Remember, he, remember he started talking like a cat in VLR. Did you he remember, really? You remember no. that? No. I forgot about that. He started like making like little cat puns like that in VLR. And it was like, what is he doing? That's amazing Isn't that you can it? remember that. Wait, am I, am I making that up? No, I feel like it's too specific. No, because that's what prompted Fi to talk about Schrodinger's cat in the last game. Because remember, he kept like, it was like, I don't know why I keep talking like a cat. And then she started talking about Schrodinger's cat. Yes, it was very weird. It was so stupid. Oh my gosh. Huh? Um, Sigma, did you just... Uh, if you can't tail, I kind of have a litter tick. Whenever I talk about cats, I... All right, I guess it's okay. That's what it is. Anytime oh. he talks about cats, he makes cat puns. He has a tick. <laughs> right. Anyway, look, there's something in the locker. I wonder what it is. Conversion plug. That's her, like, feverishly trying to change the subject. It's a conversion plug for outlets. <gasps> We can convert two prong plugs to three pronged ones. I, I wonder if we uh do it, do it. Oh yeah, hair dryer with plug. Plug it in. I have attached the conversion plug to the hair dryer. Now we can use the three hole outlet. I always want them to say something more interesting than they say. Yes. Let's open the locker. What's this? It looks like a music box, just with a large disc. I can't see it. It looks like we a mirror with a fancy like frame thing. Why is there a music box inside a locker? Runs on water. Of course it does. It's a music box. Hmm? It says runs on water up here. A music box that runs on water? Um, where do we put the water? There's a hole for a pipe at the bottom. That's probably it. What a strange music box. I wonder what it plays. Okay. Well, let's come back to it later. It's a button lock. Let's see if we can open it. Oh. Turn it all blue. Boo. 
Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you were hoping that was the solution. It won't work. It's not opening. We should search the room for more clues. Mm -hmm. There are nine buttons on this lock. Let's see if we can unlock it. Oh, we probably have to find a shape, don't we? Huh? We have to find a shape to put yeah. it in there. Yeah. yeah. Or like it an order. It won't work. It's not opening. We should search the room for more clues. Remember when we stopped reading lines last time? <laughs> yeah, yeah, because we were so fed up with it. <laughs> What's this device? There's a cover screwed on here. We'll have to open it to examine it. It must be here for a reason. Oh, is this a plug? This cable isn't connected. Let's plug it back in. Right. Oh. Oh, I think the power is on now. Okay, let's check it out. Oh. We plugged the cable into the wall, but it's still not showing anything. Doesn't look like it's broken, though. Let's keep searching around for now. Okay. Oh, we're probably gonna have to get a screwdriver. Yeah. Yeah. We could use the hair dryer for that. <gasps> I'm just kidding. It's too dark over here to see anything. We should turn the light on if we want to search here. Okay. We see a hose. Yeah, I see, I see a hose. Um... Can we plug this in here? Yay! It fits right in! Because Kimmy is right about the puzzle. What do we do now? Give ourselves fantastic blowouts with it? Um... Oh, maybe spin the fan up there? Oh yes, the word spin is on the wall next to it. Let's try it out. I like how after all that they make us... It's an exhaust fan. The word spin is written next to it. We can use the hair dryer to spin the fan. Just aim it at the blades. Do I? Are you gonna make me click on it first? Yep. Let's use the hair dryer on the exhaust fan. This should not be a multi-step process. Yeah, and we shouldn't have to comment the same thing over and over again. Violet, white, blue, red. Violet, white, blue, red. And look, it's turning. Violet. I see something in the back there. It says violet, white, blue, and red. Name of colors? Names of colors? Sorry. No, no, no. I'm just... I'm, uh, I'm, I'm giving yeah. you a, a, the Diana look of like... Girl. Those are names of colors. Girl. Very good, Diana. <laughs> I know that's not meant for me. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Um... So that's Violet, the white, blue, red. I took the long way, yep. but yeah, it's this one. Violet, white, blue, red. We did it. Good job, sweetie. Completed. Completed. Yay, it's unlocked. Let's see what's inside. Also, that was pink, not violet. A coin. Hey, this is the same coin that was in the rec room. Oh, you're right. It's a coin. I don't think it'll be very helpful in here. Well, that might not be true. We could decide something with it. A coin toss? I guess so if we can make a decision. Uh, I take that back. Both sides are the same image, so we can't use it for a toss. No leaving it up to luck. We have to make our own decisions. But we can Ooh. use it as a screwdriver. We sure can. It's a remote control. There's only one button on it. It's a baby monitor. <gasps> Perfect. <laughs> Oh. Yes. Nothing's responding. Okay. Um, Q. Great. Here's the coin. I thought you were going to go back to not press the button. And I was going to be like, what are you doing? <laughs> <laughs> Let's see what happens when we hit no. Yeah. We'll just open it with this coin. Yeah, Ooh. it's open. Let's check what's inside. That's what we're already doing, Sigma. We would be doing it if you would shut up. Let's turn the right switch off. The light on the shower side of the room turned on, but now the locker side is off. I see. Oh, so this device can't turn both sides on at the same time? That's actually stupid. Oh, uh, so now we, quote, can't look at anything over there. We can't see it. All right, well. <laughs> The water on the floor is keeping us from searching this side of the room. Are you serious? It's better that we don't step in it. The water looks questionable. 
You're right. Is there a way we can drain it? Okay, so... I do like how we are standing in it. Yeah. The light's on. Okay, right, so... The light's off. So I'm guessing we can't... Can we do anything here? We need oh. to do something about that strange, dirty water first. Okay. So let's go turn the lights back on. Yeah. Why don't we turn the left switch off? The light on the locker side of the room turned on, but now the shower side is off. Seems like this is designed so only one side of the room can be on at a time. Yeah, I was going to say. What's this hole? It's in the shape of a C. I think we can put something in there. I just don't know what by only looking at it. Sounds like Keanu Reeves. It's not really what I was going for. <laughs> Sorry, she coughed and it scared me. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> she just coughed in her sleep. That like made she's my heart moving. Start. She's moving. I know. I I heard. I was like, why do I hear her right now? Oh, let's take a look at her real quick. Can she hear us? I'm no, she can't. We're she can't. Her up. No, we're not. We're not. Is she waking up? No. no she's asleep. She's going back. Okay. Yeah, yeah. She just kind of coughed a couple times and jolted, but now she's good. This is the first time we're using any sort of like monitoring system so it's very weird <laughs> yeah hmm i think this button restarts the device i'll go back to keanu reeves that was very nice um the note we got said the door would unlock after we restart the power supply yeah but this isn't responding when we push it hmm. yeah i'm thinking i'm back <laughs> okay so this do we really not have any clues for that hmm is there or anything this. we can do with that yet? Um, oh, we have to get it water. Oh, yeah. We haven't yeah, done but, anything with this. Uh -uh. No water's coming out of this faucet. Or this one. The sink has water in it. Looks like it's plugged. Maybe we should unplug it. Oh? Huh? Now the sink on the left is making noise. Let's take a look. There seems to be some water inside after I drain the other sink. Maybe they're linked together somehow. I'm not an expert in plumbing, but that seems rather strange to do. Why are they like that? And something's at the bottom of the drain. Still can't reach it. Wait, what about this? All the water has been drained because we unplugged the drain. And the other sink made a noise. Let's go check it. So, something at the bottom of the drain. Maybe if we put more water in the other sink, it'll come up? If these sinks are connected, then it's worth a shot, at least. At least. Um, okay, so we need to figure out some way to, like, transport water. Right. Because this thing runs on water. And, um... And we need to get more water for there. And there's water here. Is there a bucket inside that one? Inside... It's too darn to see anything. Well, yeah, but like, I, I even tried this one and she was like, we can't do anything until the water's gone. Right. So wait, what is... Nothing. Do we need to have the light on on that side first? Yeah, why don't we try that? Okay. Now it does it. Of course. Good job, sweetie. Oh, the lid on the drain is open. And the odd water drained out. Now we can search around safely. We're really not gonna get the start button. There's something here. Round piece. Okay, so there's a... Right, that's what looks like on the other side. It's some kind of... It's a round piece of some kind? Maybe it's a part of something. Maybe it's a part of something. Hmm. Water's coming out of the faucet. That's how we get more water. This doesn't open. Oh, does it? 
It's a pretty normal shower stall. Oh, there's something on the wall. There's a note on the wall. Fully submerge the power supply and water to restart. These are insane instructions. Yeah. But now we can get the hose and attach it to the water supply and put that on the here, clock. Let's... It looks like a normal shower room. There's a bucket here. Is that for cleaning? <laughs> no water's the... coming out of this faucet. There's a bucket. Wear it on your head to gain defense. I think we can find another use for it aside from wearing it. <laughs> you dweeb. Mm, 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 mm. I has a bucket. Can we get the hose? Let's put some water in the... Sigma? Please take that off your head. He is very silly. Bucket of water. I call it cup of dirt. I call it bucket of water. It's a cup of With dirt. In it. With dirt in it. <laughs> yeah. Okay, wait, let's uh Wait, what? Because you're a bucket. You have the bucket in your hand. <sighs> Machines near water are usually waterproof. We'll have to really submerge it. I have to get more water. Oh, wait, no, I don't. Or do I? Oh, oh. It doesn't use up the water. Thank okay. goodness. Okay, wait. This is, they make this so annoying. I love that they explain how light works every single time we use well, the switches. Like, uh, it looks like it only lights up one side. If we put water in here, maybe the water in the other one will increase. I see. Let's test it out. There we go. Ooh. You're right. The sink over there is making a sound. Okay, let's take a look. Oh, the thing at the bottom came out. It's a key. Okay. Cool. A key. I wish this let us get out of here. Yeah, that would be so much easier. I don't think we've even seen a place for a key yet. I don't think either, because this needs a code. Right. Well, okay, let's turn on um, the other side, because we didn't finish exploring over here. Huh? What's this? A water tank? Why is it here? And why is it so shiny? It's clearly out of place. I suppose that's a good reason to examine it. Water tank. Why is it in a shower room? Oh, there are water plants in here. Is Zero planning on getting some fish? And of all places, he puts it in here. Oh, there's a cover here. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Can we use the coin we got? <sighs> hmm. I think the screw is too small. If only we had a screwdriver. Where is your coin? Can you use the key? You can't open it. Something must come out here. You could get a nice fresh cup of coffee if you put a cup here. For coffee from what, Diana? What would make coffee? Or, you know, water, plant, and tropical fish soup. Okay, okay. I know it wasn't possible, but I just wanted to imagine it. Okay. You're a weird girl, Diana. Yeah, we already knew that. Oh, I bet the key goes here. Oh! Maybe this key opens the door to the shower stall? Oh, it opened. How great is that? There's a hose here. Hmm. What could we use it for? The weird music box. We're not even going to examine it. Uh, right. We have to attach it to the water source first. What water source? That faucet, maybe? Let's attach the hose to this faucet. Nope. Doesn't seem to be the right size. The hose won't fit here. Hmm. <laughs> thought so um where else can we get water no water no water um 
And then this does it doesn't come out of work. here. Right. Does it have a shape? Mm -mm. I mean, like, kind of. Kind of? The hexagon, isn't it? No water's coming out of this faucet. Huh. You okay? <sighs> yeah, I'm just tired. Maybe we can um attach it to that first and then see. Yeah. We just need to get some running water and the music box will play. We'll just connect the hose first and place the other end in a shower. The hose might reach the shower on the far right. Then we need to connect it to that one. You mean what we just the tried shower. to do? This one? The far right. Then what about up above? We'd have to take the shower head off first, though. Oh, the water works in this shower. Hmm, the shower head's a little crooked. Are the screws loose? So we need... Okay, I've got it. We need a screwdriver. Oh, Ooh. is that what they're trying to tell us? For that and for the stupid thing. Um, let's search this in the inside some more. Um. Oh, thank you. Oh, wait, I'll come too. Hmm. Once the door is shut, there's a sealed room in here. Why are we doing this? This is the this weirdest is how, thing for us to do. This is how we submerge the power supply. We're going to flood the entire room. We can't take the power supply out. No. You got a line. You've got a line. I'm dying inside. I'm sorry. You're fine. You're right. There are no gaps between the frame and the door. It's totally closed up. Da da da. Sigma. Da da da. Oh my God! Will they? Won't they? Let's get out, yeah. <laughs> ah, yeah, I mean, yes, we should. Okay. What do we use this start button on? And what about the remote? We still got the remote. What happens? Now it's closed. So this remote controls it. So that way we can control it from in there. Oh, I see. So when we flood it, that's how we can get out. Because that's why I was like, yeah. I was I was like how are we supposed to? <gasps> Oh my god. This what? is what we needed. Oh. Is it just me or is there something strange on the drain lid? Huh? Yeah, it's sliding up. Must be fluorescent paint. See, my problem is I closed it. Right. Before we turned on the light on this oh side. Oh my god. Uh, I think those are numbers. What could they I be think, for? I think those are numbers. One, what two, else could three, they be? Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. So three, five, or no, three, three, four, eight, three, four, eight, two. Oh, I was like, what are you doing? A phone pad. I'm with three, you. Three, four, eight, two, one. It's like, why are you just saying random numbers? Three, four, eight, two, one, seven. Three, four, eight, two, one, seven. I got the rest. Three, four, eight, two, one, seven. Three, four, eight, two, one, seven. All right. Good job. Woo! Way to go, Sigma! Don't fall asleep. This is going to be an exciting episode. I know. I'm so sorry. <laughs> Leave it to me. Huh? <gasps> Something's displaying on this monitor. It's a pleasure. Oh, I like these though. These are fun. We get to connect them. I know. Um, yeah. yeah. Let's just go with that, sure. Okay. I mean, so far. So far, so, so far, good. so good. 
Okay. Right. Yeah. Wait, what? Yeah, there's a tail on the other side. Oh, oh. There's three dragons. Right? Yeah, I don't see how there could be more than that. This is it. Good job. Sorry, I didn't let you have any fun. Oh, the drawer opened and something's inside. That's okay, I'm too tired. Oh my god. It's your beloved screwdriver. Here, well, well, we're gonna zoom through this so Kimmy can see the good stuff. Um. Zoom, 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 zoom. Zoom, 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 <gasps> zoom, zoom. Oh my gosh, I just unlocked a memory. Isn't that part of this uh, a song from Xenon Girl of the 21st Century? I know you didn't watch it because you didn't have cable, but. She gets so annoyed whenever I say that. Because you say it every single time. Well, you're time. always talking about these Nickelodeon and Disney shows, and I just don't have any context for them. I think that means we need to watch Xenon, Girl no, of the 21st Century. Not. We are in our Oh my 30s. god, if we you need watching. to understand me as a person, you need to see Xenon, Girl of the 21st Century. Yeah. Just the first one. I won't make you watch the other ones. Just the first one. Although the second one's really I saw good. the promotional material for it. So the song that the like Backstreet Boys and Sync looking fella at the end. <laughs> fella. <laughs> He sings the song and he goes, I think he goes, zoom, zoom. Yeah. We removed the shower head with the screwdriver. There's a pipe here. I think we can attach something to it. How about the thing we found earlier? Does it say something? This? Yeah. I think the hose will attach here. Why? Oh, then we can connect. Right, but the locker side is dark. We should get the side bright first. Wait, what? I hate them. Why are you making us do this the hard way, Sigma? He's making- Because he sucks. Oh, oops. We'll cook the shower here. Wait, what? So they're not letting us do it? Wait. Okay, hang on. Okay, wait, wait, first. Here's what we need to do. We need to do this. Yes. Right. Oh, that's where the button goes. That's where the button goes. Right. Oh, I knew it. It's just pieces of button. Oh, let's push the button. Give me that. The pumps are working. Something came out of the tube. <laughs> this is the part that- I got sucked out by the pump. <laughs> <laughs> wow, is he shaped? I quit. No, no, <laughs> don't quit. <laughs> we need you here. The Do pe you? The people need you. I think that. <laughs> <laughs> Light turned up. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not reading it. You don't want me to. You're falling asleep. I'm trying to get you to the story part. <laughs> Instead of like us being like clicking on a hairdryer, they're like, it's a hairdryer. We don't need to hear it. <laughs> now I need to watch it. Not a girl in the 21st century. Okay, now we got both we got both of the lights on. And now now all of a sudden we can magically attach the hose. Because we wouldn't want to attach yeah. the hose on one side and then turn the lights off and then turn them on the other and attach it on the <laughs> other. We can't do that. We have to have both lights on. Oh, oh. Oh my god. That's like a cutscene almost. The music box. Is yeah, but what is it? <laughs> <laughs> I'm too tired. And then something else would happen. I like. La 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 la. Kimmy. La la la. She's not drunk. She's not drunk. <laughs> <laughs> it's been a long time since this has happened. She's not a 
pub street crawl. She's just singing along to the music box. daughter on the other side of the house. Before now, okay. And I think the key is sleep <sighs> deprivation. I think you're to right. To get you to this point, <laughs> yeah. Okay, I'm here. <laughs> oh okay. man, she even like slept all last night, so there's no reason for this. Anyway, la, la. no, <laughs> stop. <laughs> <We're> moving on. <sighs> Uh, sorry to interrupt, Diana, but the drawer on the <laughs> music box is open. Uh, uh. Sorry. <laughs> You're right. Who would have thought that my singing would open it? <laughs> She's so dumb. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, sure. What you said. <laughs> Oh no. <laughs> Are you ready to keep going? No. Are you ready to keep going? Somebody needs to get to bed. I'm so tired. Okay. Somebody's in her PJ. You <laughs> <laughs> get those clockwork orange devices for you right now. You will see this part of the game. Oh, the sad part is it's not even like. What time is it? Do we have access to it? Oh, it's like. It's not even see. midnight. We don't have access. Wait, wait, maybe I can... Oh, it's midnight. Oh, it, yeah, it is. Yeah, it is. Oh my gosh. Fill the room with water. God oh, damn it. No shit, Sherlock. Oh. It's like the beginning of 999. What's going on? Did I do something I shouldn't have? Yes, you sang. No clue, but this is bad. At this rate, the whole room will be full of water. No, no the door out is still locked. I don't want to drown. Me neither, but we still have some time. We have to stay calm and think. What should uh, we do? Uh, something changed. <laughs> I know, we'll evacuate in here. The room is sealed, but... We're in more danger if we just stay here. Let's get inside. And now we close the drain. Oh, we gotta close the drain, right. Should we make it to fill the room faster? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Yes. Yeah, let's just let's just get there. Come on. Yeah, let's go. Let's go, boys. Come on, come on, come on, come on. The lid is closed now. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, did you want to read the full sentence? No. <gasps> oh, and then it automatically. I think the water's drained all away now. Oh wow, that was scary. <gasps> the room is red. It is. Restart. Oh, this button is flashing. I didn't think you let me read that. It was, it was a doing that before. Maybe it's because the room was filled with water. The door should open if we push it. This is what the note said. Let's push it. Push it. <laughs> what? Oh. I thought. I thought it was going to open the other door. Wait, it's going to open this door? Or did it just show us another door? Huh. Oh my God. Very bright. Oh, where's my sunglasses? All right. Are you ready to listen to them? Why is there yes. a door here? <laughs> I was right. This door isn't marked on the map. The trash disposal. Room. It won't open? Yeah, that's the one with the incinerator. Nope. It's locked up tight. Oh, there's numbers. It looks like you need to put a code in here. Anything come to mind? <sighs> All I can tell is that it's an eight digit number. An eight-digit number. Oh, I don't know. We're so close to now. 
an eight digit number. No, we have to get it. We have <gasps> to get it. Oh, it would be nine digit. I was thinking it's the, like, it would be the code that we put in to the other button that you oh, did yeah. the phone thing for. <gasps> Four, eight, 15, 16, 23, 32. 42. Oh my God. No, no, <laughs> it doesn't. It doesn't. No, it doesn't. Yeah. It would be cool. But I, I remember the pattern for the other one mostly. Oh, it's not that. This is a code that we get from another timeline, I'm pretty sure. I think you're right. It's okay, we'll do this choice. I guess we we'll just die here. I'm sorry. I can't think of anything. I wonder if there are any hints around here. Hints. Hints. Come on, Diana, think. Yeah, she's like Pooh Bear. <laughs> think, think. Oh my god, I've that's... thought all the what? things I could thunk. <laughs> well, that's it. They just die in that room then? What? We literally can't do anything else. Wait, go to the flowchart. Look, where, it's all... Where are we? We're, we're here with these concurrent timelines. Oh. Transporter. Transport. And then it, and then it took us here. here. Uh, so we should go back here. We should go back here. Okay. And choose not to transport. Yeah. Let's do that. Cause because that's the only thing that we can do. Alright. Wow. Way to go. Oh yeah. For sure. Yeah. Oh yeah, cause. Because Akane already left in this timeline, so this is like a bust. Right. So if we don't transport... We die? We learn a mysterious eight-digit code? Yeah. This is how you get it. Look. What are we doing? <laughs> Diana's <laughs> destroying the transporter. <laughs> Diana! What are you? Oh my god. This has to be Zero's trap. I love trap? that's her reaction. Don't you think so? Zero's the one who made us start this thing. If we transport now, we'll be doing exactly what Zero wants. What is the... <laughs> Pretty sure we should get out of here. Let's go, Diana. I love this siren. Sorry. Yeah, it's like really annoying. Needlessly irritating. Oh, it's gonna explode? So that's just been around for thousands of years, and then she throws one well, thing at it, and it that was, destroys it. It was discovered in the 19th century, but yeah, yeah, very fragile for something so. That was like frozen in Antarctica. Yeah, so, yeah. It's after zero one thirty. Yeah. Seems it is. You're not surprised? We didn't get injected with the drugs. No. I remembered the announcement from earlier. The decision has now been concluded. Right. <sighs> oh. <sighs> the game's already over. So. <sighs> It'll be fine. Akane will come back. I wonder. I'm not so sure I believe that. Yeah, what's Akane doing? Mm hmm Cause she knew they were alive when she used the X-Passes. And you're dead. Uh, so where are we supposed to get the eight-digit oh. code? 
I am seeing a digit code. Come on. Go exploring. Was there an A digit code there? I would like to jump here, please. Oh, wait. Is this a new thing then? Oh, it is new. That's what, oh, the explanation point. The exclamation point is new. What in the world is going on? We went into the input pots, and now we came right back out of the same ones. Oh, this is like... But not the export pots. It's like a coin Did flip. Did the process fail? No, wait. Hold on a sec. I was gonna figure Let it out. Let me think about this <clears throat> for a minute, okay? Sigma's one of the explainers. Right. He helps us with the game. <laughs> yeah. He's like, this team's a Kane. Yeah. Look at her. Yeah. I get she's it in, now. She's in love. You understand what happened? Remember what Zero said. This transporter isn't one that simply teleports various objects. What is transferred is only the atomic data. Right, so it makes the a copy. does not get transferred. That's what it is. That's what I was trying to say last time. Yeah, it's like Soma. It clones them. I remember yeah. one time with my grandma years ago. The, the first time she sent me a fax, she said, The paper came back, Sigma. Maybe it didn't go through successfully. Aw, Gran. It's the same thing. Just like how the fax doesn't send the actual paper, we too... Right, makes a copy. Our original bodies remain. And only the red data went to the transfer point? But there's one thing I don't get. Why is this me, the one that stays? If our data did end up transferring correctly, it wouldn't have been a surprise to see we were in the transfer point world. So why are we still here? Sorry. I know how strange this sounds. It's clearly an esoteric conundrum. Even after thinking extensively on it, I'm not sure I'd figure it out. But I do know one thing for sure. We've run out of cards in our deck. I feel like in that situation I'd be like, what? <laughs> Yeah. Why are we talking about cards? <laughs> so, okay. Wait. This so... makes me think, like, what? Wait, now we're back here? <gasps> is that cute with zero? It sure is. Yeah. Which I have us not doing this one yet. Um... What? Here, let me look at the flow chart. Um... So you got these two locks, right? Mm-hmm. And now I got this lock. Yeah. The stranded pair. But then something else is locked. Do we have do we have any other exclamation points? Cause like we went to that exclamation point just now, and that's how right. we got it. Who killed Mira? We don't We don't know. Um We don't know who killed Mira. We don't know. We don't know Q's name. We don't know Q's name. Because we got we got the crossbow ending from shooting Eric. <laughs> the most satisfying ending so far. Right. Um uh, wait, that's that's not a thing. Uh can you go to that long one on the le very left and see yeah. This one? Yeah, I wanted to see if there's any exclamation points or uh, I will tell you that I I do remember this part and this we don't touch for a while. Still. Okay. Okay, gotcha. Um, I don't see anything. Who killed Junpei? What's frustrating is that 
We don't know who killed Junpei. And I also don't know who killed Mira. Um, Door of Truth. Yeah, we, we don't have the eight-digit code. That I know of. I don't think we do. I don't have my phone with me. Oh. Because it's, it's FaceTiming. But, yeah, because I was thinking I could look at my notes, but I, I didn't write down any numbers. It's mm. all words. Interesting. Do you think it, like, we're not supposed to glean something from the words they keep using for the codes? No. Like I, fire, we, jump, all that? Fight, no. This, <laughs> the X-Passes? No. Mm -hmm. No, the X-Passes just give you a little more insight to the characters. And you're sure that the code isn't related to that lock that we did in that no, room? it's not. Okay. Yeah, it's something okay. you've got to get from somewhere else and come back and do it. Because this game is going to really like doing that from this point on. Gotcha. Like, it's been pretty... It's been weirdly linear from this point, like we've just been doing the rooms, but now it's going right. to be like, oh, you want to unlock this? You better go over. You know what's interesting? Is that there's a lock here. Mm -hmm. There's a lock here uh, with three dice, which I'm still not sure I 100% understand, but there's no lock here for who killed Mira. Right. Makes me think that we can do that somehow. I mean, we could try. Why not? You can just jump from the flow chart, which is great. Right. Now we said me, we said Wait, Eric, Eric, we said Mira, we said Q. You didn't kill me. You didn't. We said of Gab. I didn't. I couldn't. I we couldn't said never somebody do from something. another war. Tell me who did it. Twice. Tell me the killer's name. He said they're not even in this ward. But I. 20 seconds. We said zero, That's right? That's all I'm giving you. Yeah, yeah, you sorry, yeah. Better tell me. I said Q, but I meant zero. I. I don't like liars. And we said no one. Now. We said no me. one, yeah. Who killed Mira? 19. 18. But it's like, it's not locked, so we should have the answer. But the thing is, like, I don't know. Maybe we say that. Maybe we say I don't know. Yeah. It's exactly. Huh. It's exactly enough. I don't know. I don't know. Good job. <laughs> no. I Fuck. What? This works? I thought this was like a dead end earlier until we got more info, but then I noticed that there was no lock. I'm glad we came back. Oh, sorry. Thanks. Hey. How could any of this even happen? Mira was... Everything to me. A lowly ice cream clerk and a beautiful goddess of a customer. She seemed like a rare flower, forever out of my reach. It made me happy just to see her smile from behind the counter. But I took her order and, and we spoke for a bit. Day after day, we talked like that. I wanted to be with her. If she needed help, I wanted to be there. I started to feel like I'd... Well, I'd do anything for her. Mira was the one to ask me out the first time. Every date after that, I took the initiative. I hold you like a feather. The longer we dated... The more You're like a feather in my I arms. To like yeah. Her. I want to hold you like a feather I in my arms. I really loved her. <laughs> so weird. Somehow. Why don't I just say, I think you're really I fancy or like something. She was a lot like my mother. 
<laughs> Let's to tell the truth. I don't really remember <laughs> much oh, about my mother anymore. Well, she died we think that when my brother and I were still pretty small. We, we think she that Mira killed, killed her. And right, because like she was a child and she did that. She was always smiling. And above all, her gentleness and warmth are what I remember the most. Don't worry. Hmm. I guess putting it that way, her and Mira aren't very similar at all. But still, I felt something in who Mira is. Shouldn't it be Something she? that's a lot like her. Not her? Everything just seemed so bright after I met her. This is I Eric's couldn't therapy help session. but think every day was great. Yeah. I was going to propose. I scraped together all my money and bought an engagement ring. And then... Then... <laughs> Why? Why did this have to happen? Hey, Eric. Let's work together to find the killer. I'm really sad Mira died, too. I'll never forgive the person who did it. That's why. Hmm? This is... This is what? What? Oh my god. And now we have the lock. Oh, I was, I was sitting there like, don't do it. Oh my god. So then all the places where there's a question mark, we could go back and try to like, not necessarily, because they could be there. There are still some scenes we have yet to unlock. Like this is probably a scene. Um, this is a scene right here. Then shouldn't they have locks on them? No, no. A lock is like not not that there's a lock isn't like a. I'm talking about like um, like these. See these? Oh, I see yeah. what you're saying. Okay. That's what the question marks are. I know, but they also use the lock icon. Anyway. Um, so, we still have a little bit of time, um, we could do an extra scene that's not a room, uh, okay. like this one, if you'd like. <gasps> yes, It's I the last see. one that we haven't done that we could get new info out of. Yeah, let's do it. So, alright. Reality. We got put with zero, but whatever. <laughs> It'd be fun to see him outside huh? of the screen. Why am I the only one here? Hey, Mira? Uh, Eric? Now announcing the current casualties. C-Team, Carlos, Akane, Junpei. Q-Team, Eric. D-Team, Diana, Vi, Sigma. Oh, is this the timeline where are now deceased. Mira kills the other two wards? No! She escaped. The so this is like... Has been opened, and it's like the other timeline. Closed. Yeah. The it's like where Akane just leaves. We saw this no. happen. We saw her just leave. No, <laughs> that's a lie! The decision has now been concluded. Thank you for participating. What is... Why are seven people... <sighs> okay, so Mira kills D-Team and Eric. And C team uh, just died from the. The um, game. Yeah. From the vote, I guess, in this timeline. What was all that? Why did I see C team and D team? And anyway, why am I even alive right now? 
I remember being stabbed by a scalpel. Oh, yeah. Because she stabbed Eric and then she stabbed Q. Do you right. Do you wish to Zero. I suggest you come to the quantum computer now. Everything will be explained there. Quantum computer dome? I'm glad it doesn't take us back to the flow chart after every scene. Yeah. Oh, this is, remember this is where they unchained Gab. You. You detest me, I suppose. You are welcome to kill me now if you wish. It should be easy if you put your mind to it. I, I, I want to know the truth. Well, Gab. Uh -huh. Gab. Gab's always out of place. What is this? Your spare bodies. My spare? They were prepared in order to support me and my plan. They function mainly as physical labor, plus other additional deeds. No. Then, then I'm... Precisely. You are not human. The Ooh. consciousness that is you does not reside in that body. Your thought center is there, within the quantum computer. You think, sense, and make decisions in there. You then output the results into commands that are transmitted to your body. And it then moves according to those commands. So that's why I didn't die back then. Indeed. Then me not having any memories. Clearly you wouldn't, as you've just come into existence. Only just now. Well, then, what's this? This? I know there's something here. It's warm, and it feels like it has a presence. Hmm. I can only assume it's a remnant of the boy you were modeled off of. He struggled with an incurable disease and lost his life at the age of 10. Who was he? He was called Sean. The same name as you. But that's not who I am, is it? Correct. He was simply used as the model to create your personality. Oh. Okay. I see. Then I'm just a program. My consciousness isn't inside this body. What does that matter? Have you considered humans may be the same? Not all humans retain their consciousness inside their brains. Perhaps they exist in an alternate dimension, and they may be thinking from there. They'd then send out their results via relays to their brain. If this is true, then no contradictions exist within cerebrum physiology. If the relay breaks, then your body is unable to recognize commands or function properly. Both are actual phenomena that occur. If nothing else, we're unable to prove that this theory is not correct. Um, can I ask you something? Um, can you shut the fuck up? Why did you give me a personality? Um, okay. If you wanted an assistant, uh, wouldn't a simple robot following commands be enough? I... Uh, I wanted to see the world as you did. The world of that boy. Sean. What? Uh, 
What do you mean? There will be no more. Hey, wait! We'll speak later. Right now, I have something that I need you to do. Play the game. The decision game. Why? The game's already over. That is in regards to the others. You are an exception. What? I shall explain the rules. You can see a button right here. Your choices should be obvious. Press it, or refuse to do so. And if I push it? That computer there retains all of the data that makes you uniquely you. Memory, personality, how you think and sense. All of the algorithms that determine your actions are stored inside. If you choose to press the button, all of the data will be duplicated and transferred to a virtual space. It is there that a copy of you will continue to live indefinitely. That world is created to be essentially an exact match to reality. There is no way you realize it is false. The copy of you that is inserted within the space will live a happy life. However, that is strictly within the world of simulation. In the real world, your original self will still be required to stay and exist. The original and copy have no differences. <laughs> the data is exactly the same. I'm trying really it hard. It will be duplicated without any discrepancies. Essentially, the moment you press the button, your existence splits in two. So it's One what you the other two the did. virtual space, while the other remains in reality. Oh. Then what happens if I don't want to push it? All data pertaining to you will be deleted without a trace. There are no backups. It will be impossible to recover the data. Let's see. Refusing to press the button then means your existence will be erased and you will receive a complete death. Uh, a complete death? So we want to push the button. <clears throat> like to start with. Hmm. Your fate is narrowed to three possibilities. Press the button and move to virtual space. Press the button and stay in the real world. Refuse to press it and welcome complete death. I see. You only get two options, however. To press this button or to refuse. Let's, let's refuse. And what then press. You decide. Okay. You have ten seconds. Ten seconds. Because there's and two choices after press. And there's only one after I refuse. I guess I on time. How long is it gonna make us stay here though? Oh, only ten seconds. That's not bad. Yeah. That's pretty good actually. So, we'll be deleting ourselves. Yeah. But after enduring that, like, yeah. Yeah. So, that is your decision, then. It's fine. I just want you to end it. I bet you clearly have a lot of copies of me anyway. Right. <laughs> Then, farewell. <laughs> Deletion complete. Oh, Gab. Gab. Gab liked them. You are so cute, said Gab. Gab, Kevin, don't leave me alone. Okay, well, that was a really. <laughs> don't leave me with zero.
<laughs> yeah, please. He's such a drag. He's so boring. He's the most annoying person ever. Right. Um, okay, well then... Then we go back and we press it, and then we decide whether to stay or leave. Or does it just randomly give it to us? No, no, then we'll... I think then we'll also have another decision after that. That's okay. what I'm saying. Beginning transfer of program. Dawn 7 to 9 to virtual space. Oh, okay. So they're both exclamation points. There you go. I guess we'll just click on one. I wonder if this is how we get the code. That'd be nice. Huh? Oh. Oh my god. Sean, you're awake. Where am I? W what am your surgery was a success. Your illness is completely gone now. Mom? I'm so proud of you, Sean. Dad? What's the matter? You look a little out of it. Are you alright? Oh. Uh, I think I must have had a really bad dream. <laughs> anyway, what do you want to eat when you get out? Don't say ice cream. Yeah, plan. we gotta start planning where you want to visit, too. Uh, okay. Aw, that's sweet. Congrats on getting released, son. <laughs> I thought he was gonna say ice cream and they were gonna go Thanks. see Eric. Yeah. Food's ready! Make sure to eat up! I made sure to make all of your favorites today. Wow, your meat pie! And mashed potatoes, peanut butter, and celery sticks! Yay! Hey now, don't think that's it. Oh my gosh! The game system I always wanted! And all the books I've ever wanted to read! You fought the good really life. hard it's against your sweet. illness. So you deserve a reward. I wish you could see his face. Mom, I know. thank you so much. This is the same table that Eric's family ate at. I've overcome my illness, and Aww. I'm going to school now. I have a whole bunch of friends, and I can read all the books I want at the library. I need to study super hard to catch up on all the stuff I missed while I was in the hospital. Dad and Mom, they tell me they love me all the time, and every day is fun. Aww. I gotta be the world's happiest kid. You would be. If our little one did not exist. <laughs> <laughs> well, we'll see. I mean, she's looking pretty happy to me. Happy end. Happy end. I like that oh. one. It's my favorite ending. Well, guess what? It's not on there. <laughs> Why? I think because it's not real. That's the virtual life. Yeah. Aww. We gotta keep going. In reality, is like everything stupid and sad. Uh, zero. Why is it that I'm still on this side in that virtual space? I'm well. An identical version of me is living out a great, happy life. Why... why am I here? I have an old story to tell you. A senior citizen and a boy with an incurable disease 
met at a hospital. Did the first the child was always reading books significantly above his level. Are you talking about Quark and Temioji? Yeah. Life was spent confined to a hospital bed. Wasn't that so similar to their story? Were his only friends. I think so, yeah. The boy had a special ability. He was extraordinarily gifted. His ability was highly regarded by his elder. So, in exchange for new books every day, the boy would share his academic knowledge. The boy was told that when his disease was cured, he was welcome to a job. However, if you live, you can work. Life yeah, you can work for me. Unfair. The path to the child's future closed after a variety of coincidences piled up. The boy just laughed. He never laid blame. He simply, quietly, accepted his fate. He could also be talking about despair. Sean here, like Giving the original. Giving up on his life mm. did not mean he gave up on his dreams. Before he died, he shared them with his old friend. And that dream is finally... What are you talking about? The universe. This quantum computer contains all of the infinite number of realities within space. Let's suppose there's someone, somewhere, who can fully operate that program. Perhaps he'll find that he can traverse the universe. What? Traverse the universe? 61404091. 61400. What are you saying? 4091. Be sure you remember that number. It's like, it's the same time uh -huh. time upside down. Handy. Yeah, I noticed that. That's that's the code that we need for the door of truth. No way. He said that as a joke. Oh my god. <laughs> I love how dark this game can get. Yeah, it, it really can though. Okay, we finally have the code for the door of truth. Okay. I don't think we should use it in this video, but it's something to... Should we write it down? I can remember it. I trust you. Yeah. Um... I, there's no way in hell I'm going to remember that. Right. However, there is one thing I think we should do before we end the video. And what is that? Um, I think we should go to this one. Because um, remember, we know oh, Q's name now. Oh, we can put in Sean. So we can put in Sean for the three-way standoff. Oh, yeah. Because remember, we tried to hit Q, and it was like, please enter Q's name. It's like, Q. <laughs> right. So let's see what happens. Sean. Okay. The maybe do Q Sean? Error. Q Sean. <laughs> Cute. Wait, is there a parentheses? Strange. That's really weird. Why did that not work? I don't know. Why did that not work? Why did that not work? If you put it in, please input Q's name. But we just did that. Sean. 
Yeah. Because, like, what other name is he going to have? Right. You know. <laughs> I can always tell when you're holding back. I you guess we'll just... You go like this. You go... Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you try really hard not to smile, but it always comes out. It's really funny. You're like, I don't know. Yeah, it's, uh, it's a puzzler. Well... Are you okay? That's you. Let's just go back then. They can't go see it. The, can we go back to team select? They can't see it. That's fine. They don't even see it. <laughs> they just they get to look it. at our beautiful faces. Wow. Yeah, I'm real head scratchy there. Why? Um, what? Sean. Yeah. I guess that's not his name. Um, <laughs> all right, so we've got the code for the door of truth, and we'll do that next time, I think. Let me just look at the teams real quick. No new things have opened up, yeah. So that's what we've we've got to go back to the door of truth and do that next. Yeah, but we'll do that next video. Um, but yeah, do you remember which one it is? Yes, okay. and if not, we can just go to the full chart, okay. But yeah, so uh, what did you think of? The revelation of Q's identity. Um, sad, but I liked the happy ending. And I'm, yeah. I'm sad that that's not like... The happy end is good. It makes me sad that that's not an ending included in the list of endings. Yeah. Because, like, it should be. Even if it is virtual. Yeah. It's still an ending. Do you, um, what do you think of the locker room? It's like kind of a forgettable room. I would say like, it's D tier. D tier? You didn't like it? No. It was really repetitive, like having to go back and forth with the light switch. Where would you put the healing room? Which is the one with F -tier. the changing walls. That's F tier. Oh, okay. Yeah, that's like my least favorite. Where would you put the transporter room with all the cards? B. B? Uh huh. But it was like nothing but math. All right, C. <laughs> They're going to be like, all right, F. Yeah. <laughs> After Bottom Kimmy's tier. Kimmy's puzzle room tier list. That's right. Uh, yeah, that would that would be C. Okay. I forgot how frustrated we got about the the oh, piano keys. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh my god, I'm tired. Um, yeah, let's go ahead and wrap her up. But yeah, uh, thanks everybody for hanging out with us. That was really fun. Would like you like that, to say goodbye to our precious I love that we had the daughter. roller coaster of emotions for everyone. <laughs> Yesterday, we were hangry and upset. Today, we laughed so hard I was crying. And yeah, this is a good... child is sleeping. It was a whole video without her. We did it. Oh, we did it. We finally did it. Well, I mean, we showed Yo, her on. But camera. she's not in here. Yeah, she's not in here. She's not cooing into the microphone. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh! <laughs> That's what she looks like. I love when she does her like weird inhale. <laughs> yeah, or her hiccups. She's like, <laughs> yeah. So funny. She's so sweet. All right. Yeah, we'll see you guys next time. Bye. Bye.